you're back. Are you wondering why I'm wearing the same shirt? Uh, well, I've kind of been here for four days waiting for you. But I also shaved myself with my teeth. And for those of you wondering what the answer to my question that I told you I would answer today is, I don't know. So I decided to jump around on some freedom videos that have been released in the past few weeks. And I'm going to be answering questions from there, so don't worry. I'm going to be answering the questions you left on the last video next episode. But this episode, we got to last one. Freedom, can you do a video all about how to use audio micro, please? Well, I'm gonna link some videos in the video's description, or you can click any of these two annotations. There's some information about audio micro. If you need more, though, I'm gonna pass this along to some of the other guys, and we're gonna see if we can get a video out there or not. Are we allowed to use Bitly links? No, actually, by YouTube's terms of service, not Freedom's, YouTube's terms of service, you're not allowed to redirect to another website that isn't the original intended target. What that means is, if I want to send you to my personal website, I can't send you to a redirect site with ads and stuff, and then send you to the website, because that's technically like false advertising. Anthony made an awesome video about this right here. Feel free to check it out, and it has a lot of detailed information. Bonjour, l'explication français. <sighs> so this was actually posted on the same video that I just mentioned. So let's, uh, let's give this a go. Il faut pas utiliser tags incorrects dans ton vidéo. Les liens Bitly sont contre les règles de YouTube. Et on ne doit pas utiliser de la musique sans la permission de l'auteur. One bajillion percent is not for me, but for the lols, can you give me a shout out? <laughs> hey, no. I've been gaining around 10 to 15 subscribers a day, is that good? Yeah, GG. Hey Freedom, just started my gaming channel. Well, good on you. Can you give me some tips? Because when I edit, it takes too much time. Well, well, there are actually a few different aspects to this. The first thing I would say is with practice comes ease of use. Uh, so especially when you're starting out or even just changing softwares. A bit ago, I changed fully to the Adobe software suite. So I used to use like Photoshop and so on, but I never really used to use Premiere or After Effects. And I kind of more recently switched to that. At first, it was really unintuitive, but now that I've gotten kind of used to it, it's much quicker. So that's the first thing. Second thing, in the actual software that you're using, see if there's any way to map keys. So for example, if you're doing a lot of cuts, see if you can map it to a key on your keyboard. Uh, for example, map it to the function 10 key or something like that. So anytime you need to make a cut, you just click that or map it to a mouse key. That'll make a lot of processes much quicker than having to do a shortcut or having to click on the sidebar or something like that. And the last thing I'd say is actually pre-recording, decide what you're going to do. If you have an idea on something, for example, if I had an idea on how to answer your question, I'm going to brainstorm it beforehand so that when I actually make the recording, it goes a lot quicker and it goes a lot smoother and I only have to do maybe one or two takes instead of having to do five or six and having to think it up on the spot. And before I go, I just want to link you guys to another video. Check these two out. I was just watching the video just before I recorded this, and they crack me up so much. If you guys want a shout out on Freedom, this is the place to get it. They're awesome. Send me their love. Uh, send them my love. Send them my- send them your love. <laughs> what am I saying? I now all of a sudden know how to end my videos. So if you like this video, give it a like. If you dislike this video, Give it a like. Leave a comment down below with any questions using the hashtag. Yeah, yeah. And I will see you guys next time.